Given that sec theta is minus root 5 over 2 and that theta is reflex, find the exact value of sine theta and b tan theta. Okay, sec theta is going to be equal to minus root 5 over 2. And then we know that sec theta is 1 over cos, so we'll replace with sec theta with 1 over cos theta. It's still equal to minus root 5 over 2. And then if we take the reciprocal of both sides, we get that cos theta, and we do all we do is we invert this, is equal to minus 2 over root 5. Now, if we do our South Asian Tennis Club, remember this tells us in which quadrant things are positive. Now, a reflex angle is any angle between 180 and 360. So which of these two quadrants are we going to select? Because here, remember, angles start from here, and we go all the way around here to 360. Well, cos is negative in this quadrant. So we're looking for angles in the third quadrant. So... Now, as opposed to using the Pythagorean identities, another way to do this is to draw a right-angled triangle. Make this angle theta. Now, cos is adjacent over hypotenuse. So we'll make the adjacent side minus 2 and the hypotenuse root 5. Now, using Pythagoras, we can calculate the opposite side. So using Pythagoras, the opposite side will be root 5 squared minus minus 2 squared all right minus because you've got the largest side here and you're taking away the smaller the square or the smaller side which actually gives and we have this will be the negative okay because this is negative and this is negative uh, root 5 squared is 5 and then minus 2 squared is, is 4 5 minus 4 gives me 1 the square root of 1 is uh, one so it, this will become minus one right now it's easy because sine theta is going to be opposite over hypotenuse so that's going to be minus one which is the opposite side over the hypotenuse which is root five now normally you rationalize that by multiplying top and bottom by root five So if we do that, we're going to get root minus root 5 over 5. Now, tan theta is equal to opposite over adjacent. So that's going to be minus 1 over minus 2, which gives me that tan theta is a half. So this has been a video to show you how to find the value of sine theta and tan theta when you're given a value of sec theta and the angle is reflex. I hope you've understood. This is an alternative method by drawing a right angle triangle. I hope you've understood and I thank you very much for watching.